Over-the-counter pain medications are commonly used in suicide attempts among young people. That's according to a new study from Nationwide Children's Hospital. Researchers say antidepressants were the second most commonly used drugs to self-poison among 10 to 24-year-olds. In younger children between 10 and 15 years old, ADHD medications were common and had the highest risk of serious medical outcomes. New research finds the number of seniors using antidepressants has more than doubled in the last two decades, even though the number of people 65 and older diagnosed with depression hasn't changed much. Researchers in England say the discrepancy could be due to improved recognition of depression, overprescribing, or use of antidepressants for other conditions. And cancer patients who exercise have less heart damage from chemotherapy. Researchers in Italy found endurance training is more effective for improving cardiovascular performance and reducing inflammation, but resistance training may be a better starting point for frail cancer patients. Those are some of the day's top health stories. Kenneth Craig, CBS News, New York.